So general intelligence is essentially when you build an AI that is as good, as intelligent as a human brain. Now, a bit like with the Turing test, where this was a test to determine whether or not you were talking to a computer or to a human being. And if you couldn't differentiate between the two based on the answers given in the conversation, then you had to say that the computer, if it was a computer, was intelligent. But I think we went, we've gone way, way past that now, way past that, that point. And Why are we the benchmark? Why is a human being the benchmark? Yeah, well, exactly. But, but I'm left wondering what kind of human beings the person who challenged this um, AI had normally interacted with, because you know anyone who has spoken or chatted with um, ChatGPT 4 hour or any of the alternatives, whether it's in voice or via typed method, it, it, after after a few minutes, it's pretty clear that it's either a computer or it's a a very strange human, the kind you might you might find on a sort of um, computerized help desk somewhere, um, and you can never tell whether, they're, whether yeah. they're a bot or whether they're a real person. So yeah, I am a, a bit confused as to how these things have passed the Turing test because I think it's fairly obvious after a short while that what you're chatting to isn't really a person.